slow now. Whoa. Come on. Triss could not help Geralt, yet she did direct him to Kareem Tilly, an oneromancer and an expert at finding the lost and the missing. Guided by Kareem Tilly, the Witcher had a dream. In it, Ciri and I, the Bard Dandelion, were reunited. Geralt now knew that to find Ciri, he would first need to find his dear old friend. in or buy. Morkvark sends his regards. Here. Anyone asks. I don't know him. Never laid eyes on him.
news fell, Geralt and Yen learned that Ciri had returned to the Isles. She'd rejoined her friend, the Masked Mage. They had boarded a boat and sailed off in an unknown direction. The boat had returned, one passenger on board. A creature as mindless as it was hideous. Run, Roach. Too weak to embark on a journey. Thank you, but I don't want to overstay my welcome. Besides, it's time I went home. They must all think me dead there. Right. I'm certain they await you. Greetings. What may I help you with this time? Morkvarg, got a few more questions. They'll come for my reward. But can you be sure that... Morkvarg's gone, for good. Guaranteed, or you'll get your coin back. I shall hold you to that, Witcher. You who grant us love, hatred, and strength. Reeves, <laughs> 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 they rob it. Come on, put the village fire. 
did know how to win, friends. I was provoked. Mm -hmm. Saw it happen. Wanted to talk to me about something? Amos Pharipsis. A specialist on jinns. Heard of him? I found a tome he penned in the Emperor's library. Pharipsis set off for Skelliger one day and was never heard from again. I asked some of the local folk. Some here still remember him. They know what happened to him? The locals say they last saw his ship off the coast of Hindisfjall. Then a once in an eon storm broke. So he's probably fish food by now. Not necessarily. I must learn what became of him. Why? Do you know him? No. It's not the mage who interests me. It's his djinn. Why are you even interested? Djinns are dangerous sometimes, and malicious all the time. I remember, but the advantages outweigh the risks. If I can tame a djinn, I shall gain incredible power, and that could be useful to us one of these days. You sure this mage actually had a djinn? His books strongly suggest he did. He describes taming one, harnessing energy from its power. Storm wouldn't pose a threat if he'd had a djinn. He could just utter a wish. Perhaps he had none left, or something unexpected happened. All right, so what exactly do you expect me to do? You must help me find this gin. I've no gold to offer in reward, but I shall be ever so grateful. Since you put it that way, fine, I'll help you. Thank you. A boat awaits in the harbor. Come. You've managed to prepare everything already. I have. How could you possibly know I'd agree? I didn't. Decided to risk it. Lead the way. Just once, you might try to take the initiative. Would you even let me? It would depend on the situation. Come. The landing's not far. This man will ever understand the eyes. This is Skelligar! Come. The landing's not far. The ship carrying the djinn sank somewhere in this area. Not too precise as leads go. I'll cast a spell on our boat. We'll know if there are any wrecks on the seafloor below us. All right, let's get to work. Mind if I take the helm? <sighs> I got a choice. No. How long must I wait? Are you ready to sail? Not sure this gin thing's a good idea. We managed to seize one before. Do you remember? Of course. Dandelion almost lost his voice that time. <laughs> How lucky your exorcism saved it. It was poetic. Yeah, how was I supposed to know that incantation meant be gone and plow yourself? You should have studied foreign languages. I'm gonna keep bringing that up for the rest of my life. Of course. Your last wish effectively assured it. My wish was about us being together always, not about you mocking my every mistake. Careful what you wish for. And when your wish is granted, you must accept it with all attendant circumstances. Yeah. And as for your missteps, I don't rightly see why I shouldn't laugh if they're amusing. 
There's something here, on the bottom. It's too deep here. You can't dive that long. You underestimate me. On the contrary. After all, I asked you for help. I'll cast a spell. It will slow your heart for a time. You can stay submerged longer. Asad, I cried a rithorn. Ready. Careful down there. How's your bath? Water warm enough for you? How's it going? Yeah, and you know I hate it when you read my mind. Strictly speaking, I'm not reading your mind, but using telepathy. Besides, you've nothing to hide, right? You wouldn't admit it if I did. No point. See anything interesting? A shipwreck in the cavern. I'll look inside. Not the right ship. Come back up. Say we find the djinn. What do we do? Ask for a beautiful house? And a palace? And a queen's crown? Are we still talking about the djinn? Or have we moved on to a talking fish? Doesn't much matter. Both make wishes come true. What would yours be? You learn in two things. Here, another wreck. Let's see if our gin's down there. 